Good morning guys, welcome to Kamak! Woo! <laughs> Today in this vlog we're gonna show you one of the most beautiful beaches in the world. We're gonna show you our favorite beach on the island and a really cool spot for a beer or a drink by the beach. So let me show you guys quickly what's coming up in this video. Let's go! The water is see-through guys, it feels like we are floating. Beaches on Komak, guys, are one of the best I ever seen. But Danny wanted to come here for different reason. I'm gonna let him show you why. <laughs> oh. Last thing to do in this video is to show you a really cool spot for the sunset for some drinks. Hey guys, if you're new here, we are Danny and Diggy. We came to Thailand with a plan to travel for one year, but things have changed. I love this place. We fell in love with this country and now Bangkok, Thailand is our new home. Yay! <laughs> Follow us if you want to see how beautiful this country really is. There will be a lot of good food on this channel, friendly locals, <laughs> bye -oh, bye -oh. and some great places, Thailand, has to offer. Let's go and explore the island. Let's go. Wait for me. <laughs> It's our way to our beach and this island is full of rubber plantations and they're still working ones. It's so cool to see but I want to touch it but I know it's going to get really sticky. <laughs> Let's go. Everyone is driving really slow. There's no even proper roads, mainly are just like um, concrete slabs put on the floor so you can't drive fast anyway. But yeah, we are enjoying it driving around the island. Distance between places maybe it's like seven minutes probably drive around the island, whole island is gonna be 20 in minutes so this is very small place but you have beautiful views around loads of uh, rubber trees, uh, plantation, loads of palm trees yeah beautiful beautiful place All right, we just came here to the restaurant. Basically, here is the main office where you rent uh, the kayaks. It's about uh, 300 baht for three hours, right? Yeah, it's 150 yeah, an 150 hour. 150 per hour, but I guess from what we gathered, like when you take longer, they put the price down. So yeah, that's good. Let's just get that kayak and let's go, guys. It's only 20 minutes. That's 20 like minutes, minutes, just paddling 20 minutes. Let's okay. go. We are on the way to one of the most beautiful beaches in the world. Yeah. We're ready to board our kayaks. Let's go. Look at the water already here, guys. Let's go. Minutes. Yeah, apparently it's only 20 minutes, but look at the water, wow, this is super clear, yeah, amazing, oh my god, I don't even know what this is going to be like over there, I cannot imagine, the water is see-through guys, it feels like we are floating, <laughs> tired guys we're halfway so far but the sand looks so white over it it's beautiful I think on here there's a choice of two beaches one slightly to the right and a big one on the left 
Oof. Should have had that massive breakfast. <laughs> it looks quiet over there for now, so it should be okay. We can take the drone out, hopefully. It's only 20 minutes paddle, they said. And yeah, probably it's just 20 minutes. We're just not very fit at the moment, but don't worry, we will get there. Yeah, but the reason why we paddling guys, why we took kayaks is we want to miss the crowds. We want to get there before the boats start coming in. Uh, you can get kayaks basically earlier than a boat. So hopefully we will miss the crowd and we can show you around how beautiful this place is when there's not many people there. Go Danny, go! Go Danny, go! Faster, 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 faster! You can't see the bottom here. Oh my god, look at the colour of that sea! See guys how beautiful it is around here? I told you I'm gonna take you to one of the most beautiful beaches in the world! I did! Check this out! Wow! Absolutely amazing! There is an entry fee to the island because this used to be a private resort. I think it's privately owned land. How like Songroy, Songkon, Chai Mai. Ah, okay. Uh, Siroi. Okay. So nung Song Sam si. Four hundred baht for two people, guys. Kap kung ka. Oh my god, I cannot believe this. Wow guys, this is absolutely crazy. We're gonna put our stuff and we're gonna jump in the water. We're gonna show you around the island. We're gonna show you in around one of the most beautiful beaches I've ever seen. Are you ready? Better be ready. There is some big fish here, so we're gonna take snorkels later on, but just like, I can't believe how beautiful this is. So in the price of this ticket, you get a one soft drink, so that is not too bad. Which way are we walking? Let's walk this way. But we're going, we're walking to the other side of the island to show you uh, to show you a big beach and a little bit of a different view there is a lot of boats started to coming up now but yeah yeah so they call this an abandoned resort it is in a sense abandoned as it's not used or it's not being used as a resort there's some complication i don't know what it is but as you can see the grounds are still maintained the beaches are raked it's kept clean by the owner of this island still so it's not abandoned abandoned but the buildings they still have the glass in they're still kept clean it is becoming slightly overgrown but i think that's just to make the place blend in with the nature again maybe one day it will open i don't know would you stay here no if they don't have a beer wow Oh my god, this sand is so soft, so so soft. If one place we've been that was like this was once in Cambodia and it's very similar, it's like powder. Let's go. Oh. 
Oh my god, it is. It is so soft and it's so white here as well. The sand is so white. The beautiful palm trees behind us. Again, paradise guys. Coma has the best beaches. Beautiful guys, beautiful. It's for sure worth taking a kayak and coming here just before everyone else turns up because then you have a piece of paradise just for yourself. I think the time now is around 10 o'clock and we had about yeah. three boats turn up in the first 10 minutes. Yes. So it's getting a bit busier. Yeah. But still loads of space on this big beach. Everyone's yeah. going to the little one we were just on. So we might move later on because we don't like crowds. This is probably why we didn't like Phuket that much. Phuket is so busy, honestly. There is, you can't really call it paradise there. Some people might argue with you, Winnie. <laughs> Some people might argue with me, yes, of course, but my paradise looks a bit different. So we came to the quieter side of the island, guys, there's not many people here, there's no kids shouting, so it's much more peaceful, beautiful palm trees as well and super soft sand, but now we're gonna go and explore, we're going into the abandoned hotel. Ready? Let's see. Oh, I hope nothing's gonna bite my feet because I left my flip-flops in in a kayak, but hopefully it'll be okay. Ooh, out! I just stood on something. But this would be such a nice place, honestly, if it would be open. Check out the swimming pool. Look at that. Look at it over there. I could stay here. Yeah, just be careful, Danny, where you stand because it could be some glass here. And views are incredible. Let's go and find Danny. Okay. Okay. This is your terrace. How big is it? It's huge amazing views as well i think there's one more level but i'm not going through there because there's glass everywhere but imagine if this was open this would be like five star luxury this would be easy infinity pool <laughs> bit dirty <laughs> We show you the abandoned ship in Kochang. Now this one. Look behind me. How amazing is this? The water, water color is like turquoise green. I wish we could live by the beach. One day, one day we will. I'm getting diggy coconut. I don't have to climb the tree. <laughs> well, come on then. <laughs> it won't come off. I need a knife. All right, let's go back to the V Beach and show you some of the lovely views around here. You can see behind me that slowly the nature is starting to overtake, which it looks pretty good. Sure, but as you can see, this side of the beach is much, much quieter and there is more to do. You can explore a bit more here. So yeah, I do prefer this side. Let's see the view from this building, guys. Oh wow, 
Look at this view, guys. Oh my. Oh my god. Yeah, so Dickie's taking some pictures for you guys on Instagram. If you don't follow us on Instagram, go and check it out because you can do some really cool pictures. But like you guys, I love exploring these kind of abandoned places. And in Ko Chang, Ko Mak, there's so many of them. I think we've seen three abandoned places so far here. But I just love wandering around them, it's interesting. But yeah, check out the pool down here. Let me turn you guys around, look. I don't know if I jump in there. <laughs> it's time to get a dip in there because it's super hot. Drink some water, rehydrate. And we'll be heading to one more beach today. Yeah, let's go grab our free drink you get when you come here and go and chill on the beach and relax because it's getting hot it's getting close to midday yeah midday almost midday now so yeah we're gonna rehydrate chill a little bit maybe go for a snorkel because actually it's quite good snorkeling around here guys and then we are taking you to one more beach today yeah so guys i love this island one is the beach the beach is beautiful and the sand is so soft it's like powder and also the water is the bluest we've seen on Komak and anywhere around here even on Ko Chang it's so blue and beautiful right let's get back to the beach enough of this urban exploring and the buildings we're going back down to the beach jump in that water get a drink and chill let's go it does look a little bit creepy around here i wouldn't walk in here by myself uh, i haven't seen any spiders though lots of webs Right guys, we just been for a dip. Danny decided to take the drone out for you. Check the views out. Check the views around the island, guys. Whoa, <laughs> what are you doing? Have a look, it looks amazing. Before we head back, we've got one more beach to go to, guys. Let's go. What do you think of this video so far? Do you like it? You enjoying all the beaches we're showing you? If you do, don't forget. Oh my god, we're just getting our drink. As you know, there's a free drink with the entry ticket. So busy now. Look at the difference when we got here first thing in the morning. And look how many people is here now. Loads of people. So just quickly wanna add, wanna add, they have some beer here. They have Chang, just seen it over there. So 
You can even get a beer here if you want. Yeah, they got Chang, they got crisps, they got pot noodles, and that's about it. Yeah. <laughs> and sodas and stuff, so normal sodas, water. So there's a little stuff you can have if you didn't bring anything. But I'm just looking at that water in front of me and I cannot believe the color. I still cannot believe the color of it. It's so beautiful. Okay. You're going in the front, yeah? Yeah, I'm going in the front. Let's go. Oh. We only just going over there, guys. Oh wow, look at the water. You just chill for a minute. Let me paddle for a bit. You relax. Okay. Okay. I have no problem with that. <laughs> yeah. Danny, have we got our uh, how, have we got our bag? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, this is absolutely worth doing it, guys, and it's a must if you're in Komak, I think. Hey. Hello. <laughs> It's a bit wavy on the way back, but not too bad. Nice easy paddle back. We're gonna chill. Oh big waves here from the different boats guys. But it's okay, Danny is experienced kayaker. So we're gonna be fine, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. All good. We've only got another maybe 100 meters and it should be flat. You used to go to kayak school, did you, when you were little? Yeah? School. <laughs> what was it? I used to do kayaking, yeah. Yeah, Danny used to do kayaking when he was little. A little baby. Oh. Wavy mate. Wavy. Main thing is, do not drop the camera, Diggy. Which way are you going? Uh, Wanna go that way? Uh, uh, <laughs> um, uh, you got enough? Yeah. It's, it's so hard. That's what? There you go. See, it's a bit rough. I'm literally paddling and I'm not moving anywhere. Danny has to do it. He's got stronger arms. Later. <laughs> We're nearly on land. <laughs> Bye. 
Alright, the place where we're going guys is called Hidden Beach Resort. We said, beginning of the video, we're gonna show you the best beaches on the island and this is one of them. I like it for one particular reason, you'll see in a minute, I've seen some pictures of this place and it looks a little bit different. So let's go and show you guys and I want to see it too, let's go. We're just parking the bike and I'm looking at the beach now and it's wow factor, another wow factor. The beaches on Komak guys are one of the best I ever seen and you know what is the best about them? Is that they are not crowded at all, beautiful sea, warm, loads of swimming fish, palm trees, what more, what more do you want? Yeah and beautiful husband to go with it. Hello, man. So we're just moving away a little bit from the bar because it was quite noisy over there. But check out this spot. Check out the spot we're gonna have. You got hammocks here. You got you are surrounded by the palm trees. You can hear the birds singing. This is beautiful. So yeah, this is another great spot on the island. It's uh, very quiet in here, so I'm not gonna shout. Uh, but yeah, why is this spot great? Because they have, they do have some snacks. They, they have a bar, but also you can find very, very quiet space for yourselves. There are cam hammocks over there. Couple people is chilling and sleeping, I think. So we're gonna be shh, quiet, but it's perfect spot for the relaxation. And the look at the palm trees behind me, guys. They're just going into the water. Another paradise beach on Komak. But Danny wanted to come here for a different reason. I'm gonna let him show you why. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh god, just pull over like he wasn't any rockstar. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, just landed on my ass. Drinks are ready. Cheers. I made these fresh for you. That's good. I think it's like a um, passion fruit, soda. What else is in there? Vodka. Ah, vodka. Cheers, guys. Yeah, guys, the reason I wanted to come here was because I saw these pictures online and it showed this really cool thing. Look behind me. You got a pirate ship. <laughs> Check it out. Yeah, so I think this used to be a bar, but it's a bit, you can't walk around it anymore because it's a bit creaky and it looks like it's going to collapse. But how cool is this to have this on the beach? Imagine if it was still a bar. It just looks cool in the pictures. I wanted to come and see it, really. But the beach is really nice. Diggy showed you already. The beach is beautiful, really nice. And the guys are very friendly. It's the resort, you can stay here as well if you want to stay here. And again, it's not miles, miles out of the way. It's an eight minute drive from where we were at the last beach. Check this out, how cool. Right, let's get to the beach, because it's hot. Let's go. All right guys, we just had a quick cocktail refreshment on the beach here. We're moving now. We're going for a quick bite to eat and we're gonna take you to my favorite beach on the island. What do you think, Danny? Is that your favorite beach on the island as well? I think so. I think so. Yeah. The other one doesn't count because it was another island. <laughs> <laughs> but it's one of the most beautiful beaches in area. Yeah, so I just chatted to the owner and that ship that I showed you, that bar, I thought it was shut down, but in the next couple of weeks, if you're coming here, they're gonna stick some lights up and that bar's gonna be back open so you can sit on the pirate ship and chill. 
How cool is yeah. that? <laughs> Komak is becoming one of my favorite islands in Thailand. It's always quite cool. It's a bit weird, but I actually like you have a basket on your bike. It's so easy just to chuck stuff in rather than keep opening this thing up all the time. You chuck loads of junk in here. Got drinks, fanny pack, <laughs> Fanta. <laughs> Nice well, Fanta is going to be nice and shaken, isn't it? Yeah, shaken, not stirred. <laughs> right, let's get out of here. So that place is called Hidden Beach Resort, guys. Make sure you check it out when you're on the island because it's really cool vibe here. People are lovely and friendly. Everyone's smiling, having a good time, chilling right by the palm trees. Perfect spot. Right, let's go. Jump on. Make yourself, make yourself in position, mate. Cheers, thank you. Bye, guys. Thank you. Cheers. Bye. <laughs> so you can actually rent these golf buggies as well. If you're on this island, you can rent the golf buggies, which is quite cool. So yeah. If you're not confident riding a motorbike, yeah. rent these. Stay there. That's a really great idea. It's a good option, guys. Yeah, everyone can drive a golf buggy and the electric ones. They're really easy to drive. Go, stop. Go. Stop. Stop. <laughs> on this island guys you do not have 7-eleven and it's a reason for it this island wants to be more local they want to support locals so no 7-eleven here remember that but there is a plenty of other local shops which they and they have literally everything there yeah they have the same similar stuff so snacks Chris medical there's a pharmacy but there's no big corporations on this island, not one. No. So you won't find any corporation, not one on this That's island. That's why we love it. Mm. All right, isn't it? You gonna look at Ben over, lady? There's also some kind of random things on this island. Uh, this, for instance, let me show you guys. <laughs> there she is. Doing harvesting. What, with the boobs out? Yeah, why not? Maybe she's hot. Yeah, guys, this is just like in the middle of the road, in the middle of nowhere. When you guys who live here or been here, what's this all about? Let us know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a weird one. But the thing is, it's not hidden away. They've actually cut out the bushes so everyone can see it. Yeah. So it's, a bit, it's a bit random. taking turn into the home hug beach bungalows check out these views we even not on the beach yet and the views are amazing So the place we are taking you now is the place where we're staying, Komak Home Hug and Beach Club. And it's located on Aukau Beach. This is our favorite beach on the island, so enjoy some amazing views. Right guys, so it's sunset hour now 
last thing to do in this video is to show you a really cool spot for the sunset for some drinks. What's really cool about this place is there's nothing's really over two mm. floors here. So to get somewhere where you can go above the palm tree slightly and get a cool view is quite rare around yeah. here. So let's go check it out. Let's go. So this place is just right on the beach where we're staying. So you're gonna see uh, how close it is. Basically, I just left the house over there and it's just right in front of me there. And that place is called Ocean Rooftop Bar. As always, link in the description. guys look around this is a really really cool spot on the island check out the view behind us Woo! palm trees see the sun is setting right over there they have some bin bags as you said when you look along this beach or look across any kind of beach all the buildings are low rise it's normally just one floor but you can see here you're above everything they're so cool and this view is going to be amazing we show you guys but the sun's going to set directly in front of us Beautiful, Soy Mac. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put you down now, but enjoy the B-roll, enjoy the beautiful sunset on Alcao Beach. So we just ordered our drinks, we've got two caprinias. We're gonna finish the video here. I hope you liked Komak. I hope you liked what we showed you. We absolutely love Komak. The Komak is one of the most beautiful islands, one of the most beautiful places we've ever been to. I agree. I think these islands in general, this island is it's beautiful. And it's a must visit if you're in Thailand. If you can come this way, instead of going to Smui, Koh Tao, Koh Panyang, yeah, try come this here. Way. Yeah. Try it. You won't be disappointed, guys. No. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for staying with us to the end. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video guys and leave it a thumbs up if you can. Subscribe, you want to see more content from Thailand. Mm -hmm. And we'll catch you in the next video. Bye! Bye!